In year 10, I had a huge crush on a really cute boy, Jaden. We started going out. He asked me to send him an intimate photo. I trusted him. I thought it was just between us, but he shared it with his friends. That's when the problem started. Jaden's friends shared my photo online with a nasty story about me. Everyone saw the photo that was meant to be private. I spoke to my friend who said that I should report it, but I thought it was my fault for sending the photo. I felt so embarrassed. I didn't want to talk to anyone or go to school, and the thought of my parents finding out made me feel sick. I didn't know who to talk to. My friend asked if I was okay. She noticed I wasn't acting like myself. She encouraged me to speak with the guidance counsellor at school. It was hard to tell the guidance counsellor what had happened, but she made me feel a lot better by explaining it wasn't my fault. She said it's okay to say no when someone asks for an intimate photo, even if it's someone you trust. She also sat with me while we went to the eSafety website to see what advice they had to help me. The school also helped me to tell my mum. And the principal explained that this can happen to anyone, along with how it could be a crime. Jaden and his friends had to explain to the principal and their parents what they had done and how it could have very serious consequences. Even though it was difficult, I felt so much better after reaching out to my friends and speaking up. If you're being cyberbullied, speak up and tell someone you trust, whether that's your friends, a trusted adult, Kids Helpline, or Headspace, because we all have the right to feel safe online.